Hello there and welcome to update 5. Let me just quickly pause the game. We don't want to waste any any time in here. So um, after, I think we're about a month late into update 5, but we are finally here. This is update 5 with bad water. And uh, here we go. So it's taken me some time to get ready. And uh, yeah, I think most of the time went really into looking or finding the right map. So I don't know if that's the one. This one uh, was called, if I quickly look it up uh, over here, Split Waters Build, and it was part of a build a map contest number three. So I'll uh, definitely link the map in the description below as well in case you want to follow along. But uh, yeah, that's so. Um, <laughs> that's that's what we have over here. I um, There was quite a few maps, I, I think I spent a couple of hours trying to get the right one, but there was quite a few maps that I really wanted to try. There, there was one, a, quite a large one. Actually, yeah, all of those maps that I've been looking at are quite large, actually. Um, it seems I'm not a huge fan of tiny maps, but essentially, yeah, there was one really cool map that I loved with some massive cliffs, but the problem was the the bad water was kind of like tucked away in a corner, corner somewhere and hidden away, so... It sort of felt like, well, if we choose the map, then uh, yeah, it's not gonna, we're not gonna be able to um, test out all its functions. So, but here we go. We've got rivers. It seems like all of them, all, almost all of them, are already contaminated, except with the exception of this one. If we hide the water real quick, let's go back over here. It seems we are very close to this contamination zone. So yeah, I've, I'm going to have to do some more reading. I just wanted to jump in head on first, see what happens. I read the notes, I think it was about a month ago as well when it first came out. And uh, yeah, so I'm not really sure. I know that there was something to do with if you, if you mix the water, this one should be sort of fine and we can still grow things in here. I mean, food and uh, and trees, as we, as we can see. But once it turns into this really highly concentrated lava mass, then it no longer helps us or allows us to grow anything. So that, that's what I understand, basically. Okay, so our starting point is here. It seems we've got some access to the water and uh, some trees as well. Well, we're going to have to cross over some dead trees, some food. And, I mean, it's it's a okay location, I suppose. So the map creator said as well, it's uh, recommended to start with the normal mode. So that's exactly what we're doing. I mean, it, it is our first time after all, so, so yeah. Okay, so I foresee that we might not be really pushing into this area in the future. I think I... Hmm, yeah. I have a feeling we might want to push towards this zone. Block this off. Because that is the only super clean water source we have. I mean, I don't know if we can still drink this water here or not. It might get a little bit sick. Uh, <laughs> so this is the zone and as per usual we're gonna have to rush for the planks as well because that is the most um, important thing oh yeah the forest here get some trees growing that's gonna keep us alive for quite some time but uh, what I have noticed is there's quite a few different things over here so the blueberries are the same coffee bush okay so that's a bit new birch pine mangroves and we get some mangrove fruit as well and an oak tree Okay, I believe we had another one in update 4, or maybe that's with the folk tales right now. Anyways, so let's um, figure this out. I don't think our district is going to remain here. Um, well, food is going to have to remain here, but district center, I'd like to move it over in the future. So let's try and bring this. <laughs> so we're going to cross over from here, or maybe from here. Seems like a pretty solid junction, so... Okay. It's gonna happen behind. We might want to do roads all around us. <laughs> okay. That's where it is going to be. Let's close this one. And a couple of roads as well, so... To get water... I suppose we can suck it out from here. Plant, okay, let's let's plan this out. So water suckies go here. Couple of roads. We're gonna get them connected up as well. Wanna give them a slightly more direct route. Mm -hmm. Well, let's not worry about it too much, so we can always change it up a little bit later. Uh, you guys will do one right about here, and that's the food. Now we are gonna need some 
some trees and logs as well. So you might go here. <laughs> More direct route through there. And uh, not to worry, we are going to switch it up as quick as we can. So priority wise, highest, second highest. All right, off you go, Beavis. Now crossing over, we might be able to grab a few trees from the other side as well. So I was thinking when I was looking at this map and sort of scouting out the areas where to go and um, yeah, so not a lot of trees, so that is quite problematic. So I felt like, okay, so how can we cross over? We could get those platforms, but that means we need a hundred of science. This reminds me, we should probably put a few of you in the science department as well. <laughs> okay, anyways, yeah. So then I realized, actually, never mind, we can do dams over here. So if we place one of those dams right about here, let's pause it for the time being since we don't have any logs. Okay, so we can do one dam here, we can open you up, and this can help us put some roads down. Hold on a second. This might not be the most direct route, so... Mm, no. But when the drought does come, we want to keep as much water as we can. Uh, yeah, so fine. Let's uh, leave you here. Hook it up just like so. Couple more roads over there. And voila, what's happening? Oh dear, we forgot to highlight these areas. Okay, now you got some trees to harvest. Uh, you're gonna have to go here as well and let's see this road goes here okay another one place you here and you are gonna be able to harvest everything from here so that's great okay let's mark all of those trees for harvesting as well I don't want to mark them once just yet let's do every other line of trees okay Lovely, so that's the start of it. The rest of it, I think it's fine. There are mostly birch trees here anyway, so... Lovely. Uh, we got a few logs in. <laughs> are we harvesting food? Yes, we are. Next one's gonna be you over there, isn't it? And I mean, I suppose we can do the same here as well. Let's just grab a couple of you guys. Okay, lovely. Now, what's happening over here? I don't want them... Hmm. Well, I want to give them slightly more direct routes where and when possible. Let's try and plan out as much as we can as well. The next thing we are going to have to start producing is... Oh, food. Let's do food. That's probably the next thing we need. Okay, place you here. Let's have a look at the crop section. So, kohlrabi... Cassava, soybean, canola, corn, and eggplant. Oh, wow. That is all very new. And uh, something I noticed. Well, I don't really know. That, that's as far as I went. Other than, uh, I mean, checking out different, different plants over here. But I noticed as well that the farmhouses are a lot smaller now. And then we have this fermenter over here. And it apparently ferments plants to produce nutritious food. Does this mean that these plants are not edible at the start? Must be, right? I mean, they must be edible. But I guess we'll find out. You're gonna take 25 logs and you need power. So we're gonna have to create some sort of power power zone over here. Let's have a look. So, yeah, what water is gonna push through from here. But we also need to limit it. <laughs> oh, that's the wrong thing. Okay, here we go. You, let's pause you for a second. Maybe speed up that time just a little bit. Um, hold on a second. You guys should probably... Yeah, let's work a few more hours. Do want a storage at some point as well, but is it the most important? Uh, not just yet. Let's do the farm first. We shall plant quite a few different ones. Uh, like so, I think that should be... Should be a good start, right? And then we want to utilize as much of this space here as possible, so... Yeah, let's do another three, so... Really hoping this is going to sustain our colony for the first few... Few days, so... You are almost full. We've got quite a few logs. Uh, you guys are building... I'm thinking we'll do the dam next. Sort of try and future plan 
our route through here. So this is where we're going to go. I'd like to place the forester right about there. But before we can do the forester, we are going to need some... <laughs> where are those roads going to go? So... Oh, I probably don't want to cross from here, do we? Somewhere here is a little bit better. But, um... Let's do one over here. It's it's fine for the, for the time being. Next, we are... Well, we got some trees over here and there. Just thinking, okay, what's happening? We need a shelter and we have a bit of a need for the thirst as well. We should have water over here. Hmm, okay, let's see. Well, the farm is now done, which is great. So is our... Let's take one of you guys out. We really need a worker over here. Uh, plenty of logs, so yep, one of you are going to be paused. You're actually full as well, so let's pause the both of you. The food we have, although not a lot. Oh, another thing we do have to do. Let's go housing. I think that's where it was. Breeding pods. Yep, we are going to have to place down a couple of you guys right about there. Maybe even four, who knows. I mean, yeah, I'm uh, pretty excited to try out and play with the with the Iron Teeth. Once again, it's been such a long time. Our last playthrough was with Folktales, and although the windmills would be would be lovely to have, it's also nice to have water pumps that are a little bit a little bit longer. So maximum depth is six, and yeah, let's see how it goes. Um, we'll try and skip tonight as much as we can. Everyone's still, unfortunately, gonna be sleeping on the floor since we haven't given them any houses just yet. Um, if we... Okay, we do have a spare beaver right now, so you... Quite a few construction projects over here. So you can go there. Okay, so dam is ready. Let's um, demolish this blockage over here. Highest priority to get this done right away. You guys are a bit hungry and thirsty right now. Fine, go over there. Uh, <laughs> for the time being, let's do a, another gatherer flag. Okay, planting is going well. First of the breeding pots is ready and the water is now finally flowing through. This means we might want to stick the dam right about there as well. Over here, I think we're fine. Yep, we got the natural blockages over there. And the rest over here is good, right? Oh yeah, water's coming in. Well, fortunately the trout's are a little bit... Oh wow, that looks pretty vicious over here. So maybe it's good for electricity production as well. Okay, so what we can do is let's bring those gatherer flags... Not gatherer flags, the lumberjack flags a little bit closer. Okay, couple of you guys. We should probably start storing... Let's see, a bit of food. Let's bring it a little bit closer to us. This could be farmlands in here, but oh well. Let's um, turn it into... Do we see berries? Yes, we see right over there. And the same with water as well. Would be useful to have a couple of tanks. Let's do one over here. Okay, research points. Oh yeah, let's not forget about it. It's very easy to get distracted. You're halted because you don't have water. Berries, okay. Right, speed it up. We'll do another hut over here as well. I'd like to have three running if possible. But now we've got to look after their well-being as well, so they become a bit more efficient for us. So, okay, fine. You guys get um. <laughs> we might want to do a road from here. So, I don't really know where we want to go. Okay, let's let's place you over here. So it kind of blocks this off. Maybe we'll cross over from there. Okay, now next thing, we are going to want to start producing planks. Okay, we have enough food right now. Uh, actually, no, we don't. That is quite the uh, quite the opposite. Let's... Um, okay, road, gatherer flags, highest priority, here we go. Let's uh, make sure we are not going to forget, so 65% uh, three days in total. You seem to be full. There's a couple of you there. One beaver spare. Okay. I 
think I'll feel much better if we have one beaver ready. No, never mind. We have a few things to build, so let's do a third one in here. Okay, what happened now? Pretty sure we had a few spare beavers, but... Oh, that's why. Okay, so... Extra beaver in these sections. Here we go. We still have one more. Okay, these flags are done as well. Maybe you can go over... Thirsty, thirsty. We do have water. Hold on a second. Let's designate you as water. Okay, so... Things are starting to take shape a little bit. We've got 30 science already, so the next milestone is... How many? 60. Halfway through. Houses, well, not being constructed, and we don't have a ton of vlogs just yet, so... Um... Fine. It It's okay. They are going to be harvesting them pretty quickly, though, aren't they? Yeah, these ones are empty. We've got three harvesting food which I don't think we need, which means we have a spare beaver now. So let's do another one here. Okay. Uh, and then we'll try and... I guess make our way through. Okay, lovely. This is looking good. Speed it up again. Do we have anyone spared? Nope, you are just sleeping over there. A second... Ah, oh, lovely. Okay, so that's going to go a lot faster now. And we are giving them a house as well, so if we want to make them super happy, I mean, campfire isn't too expensive. And it would give up their, or get up their <laughs> bonuses. Let's have a look. Can grab one of you guys. Yep, right now, no bonuses to running, health, or, or life ex expectancy, or working speed, so which is, uh, you know, a bit sad. But, um... Okay, we have a one, one spare beaver now. Right, so 95%, let's not mess around. We are going to unpause you. Bombs open. Here we go, you almost done as well. Oh, we're not going to have a spare beaver. Well, at least we have those breeding pawns ready, so that's, uh, that's great. And a water tank as well. Yeah, I think we can feel pretty good about this now. I mean, the next big problem, although it is a normal mode, looking how to save this water, it, it's a bit tricky. So, what seems, I mean, okay, let's try again. So this lake over here, the water sources are right in the middle, and this side as well, and it can flow doo -doo 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 -doo, all the way <laughs> here. And this is really far from us. To get all the way there, to put some dams down, it's quite a challenge right now. Yeah, it would be too difficult. What would be much easier is if we had dams over here. And if we go the levees way, that's 120 science though. We place them maybe, I don't know, somewhere here. Yeah, so have some of this uncontaminated uncontami water contained in this zone. Okay, that was a, that was a mouthful, but okay, here we go. First off, the kohlrabi is coming through as well. And how's our house doing? 34 blanks, not blanks, logs are in. You guys are looking good. Okay, so next step, we are going to have to produce blanks, aren't we? Because we are very... Oh, dear, we are almost there, actually. Pause it for a second. Our flank... Blank? Not flank. Blank production soon. Right, right, right. So if the forestry is going to be here, I would... Hmm, <laughs> consider... Okay, power. Crossing over from there. That's a bit annoying. Would have been easy this way. I mean, I guess we could go from here as well, but anyways. One over there. Not right now. This guy. And this guy. Okay, maybe pause one of them, because we don't need both. And then we shall do our... Lumber mill right about here, but the problem is... There's nowhere for them to go, and this is... Ah, okay, fine. Let's uh, let's do it this way. Roads over, bit of a, a runaround, but hey, it, it's fine. So 25, we have a house now. Okay, well being... I, I know, I think in the past, what was it, three, three seasons or four seasons, 
I see that the star all the time that let's let's try and focus on the well-being now and then I mean I suppose in the last few seasons we've done a little bit better but but uh, well, what I'm trying to say is let's uh, let's try and figure how we can look after their well-being even better this time so this might not be the best location but it's fine we've got some blocks now let's put a campfire here at least they can have some s'mores Oh, here we go. Well-being is now level 3, which means... I have no idea what this means. Oh, let's grab you 10% into construction or working speed. And they run 5% faster as well. Alright. Well, there we go. This is pretty lovely. Let's speed this up as well. Oh dear, come on guys. Let's, uh, let's get this done. How many construction beavers do we have? A slightly lower priority... You're harvesting alone, maybe, just maybe, let's have a look. So we've got a few in here. Okay, forget the berries, get into this house instead. Hello? Okay, there we go. Now, we've lost the beaver somewhere. Not a clue where he or she might have gone. Hmm. Did we build something else somewhere? Oh no, we have two in here. We paused one. Anyways, okay. Let's have this built then. We're still gonna need a spare beaver, which means... Uh, don't wanna cut down on the food. Yeah, food's gonna be quite important. Maybe we shall... Oh, construction beavers. Yep, there we go. Let's get those built. 20 logs. We are gonna be a little bit short. I am very glad that we finally have the forester. I mean... Cycle 1, day 6. I guess it's okay. It's not the worst, but it's not the best either, is it? Yep, yeah, you are gonna go right about there. Uh, in the future, probably we shall try and bring you a little bit closer. Hold on a second. What if we just harvest... Okay, cancel all this, cancel all that. And if they keep going like so, then we might be able to push it a little bit closer to the green area. Because there's no point keeping it so far away, is it? Yeah, let's bring it as close as we can. Okay, fine. We've, um, one of those. Oh, wait, you can have two beavers in this station over here? I don't think that was a thing before, was it? No. So that's pretty cool. Is this like an improved... No, industrial lumber mill. Okay, so because it's industrial, we can... <laughs> okay, very lovely. Now, can we push this even closer? Oh, yes, we can. Uh, this one goes out of the way. Can we place a road? Please, yes, and thank you. Right, so... I believe it is time to place all of them back here. Let's harvest a couple more trees. I definitely want to get rid of all the burst trees over here and what we shall do well you are going to be at the highest priority and i really need someone here as well okay slightly lower priority for you i'm afraid okay it's fastest speed for getting through the night few roads and for the trees okay so Oak it is then. Mangrove spines. Wait, what are we missing? There was another tree that gave us... Oh yeah, we got no potatoes and that kind of stuff anymore. Let's see what this fermenter does as well. So let's... Uh... Hmm. Okay, I suppose this is fine. Road straight through. There we go. And we should probably start thinking about storing up some more water as well now, don't we? Bigger container we don't have, so we shall place a small one uh, somewhere over there. Okay, lovely. How stuff? This one should be done ASAP. I definitely need someone working here as well. And to plant trees, we were very close to doing it, but then got distracted yet again, so... Tons of trees shall go 
all over this place okay lovely and you can reach all of this as well so i mean those trees do take 30 days to grow which is a very long time of course but i think we might be able to yeah maybe push into this zone over here and find some alternative options for our logging industry okay now are we getting a campfire who knows our next things to unlock we have a bit of science now i would always like to have a bit more wait we still have homeless beavers as well so that's a bit sad okay fine let's um uh -huh. okay well constructing might be better in this area over here yeah so this is gonna be production zone we'll probably have the mills and things a little bit closer actually we probably don't have to worry about it too much right now as long as we don't take over all that green space in here like we're not gonna place farms here are we no let's have a look at this platform here as well oh you're also a hundred wait hundred over here do we need anything else no your mentor is almost done now the levy okay 120 so i mean we're not gonna build a ton of levies just yet however a slightly more direct route to crossover might be a little bit more beneficial for us so let's let's do that oh yeah the uh ladder 70 for you you are going to fall we have some logs okay i think things are starting to take shape a little bit aren't they yeah so you can take logs highest priority because i think someone's a little bit full over here you are already planting oh yes okay okay dokie let's uh i think now that we do have a forester in place we can confidently get rid of everything in here oh yeah i really don't like those birch trees i mean some might say yep yeah, they grow very quickly bit of emergency logs but we just don't need them okay now it does look like we have a quite a solid foundation already in place food's okay water is not so good but it's fine they'll survive got a few logs as well and a storage now science is going up pretty quickly and we are uh well we're doing something here aren't we oh can't do anything in here apparently and then um yeah we'll just try and get some more food as well and then and give them some more living space in here so okay that's gonna be it for the first episode in the next one let's try and figure out how we can sort of block in some water make it a bit more safe and I think it's time to start looking at what are some of the new buildings that we have access to now as well. So since it is my first time playing this, there's probably quite a few mistakes we're making here, but that's fine. I'm sure we'll survive. It's not like it's a hard mode or anything, so I'm sure we'll be we'll be able to survive in the in the normal mode. But if you have any tips, make sure to let, let us know. And of course, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.